Welcome to my channel, Planning with Maserati. I'm going to be doing some Happy Mail from Parku. Um, I did a video before with them, you know, showing some pens. I ended up getting some more, so they're letting me do a review on it, which is great. So before I begin, I'd like to tell everybody welcome. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and share the video. That'd be greatly appreciated. So I did go ahead in sake of the video, um, open the bag so that, you know, I don't have to deal with that part of trying to get this bag open. But again, it's from Parku Shop. Let me see if I can show it to you. And yeah. So right here, P-A-R-K-O-O -O shop. And I will link all their information below so that you can have it. So with that being said, let's begin. I'm so excited. So what you get is this little packing slip type thing. And I'm going to read it to you because it's, I mean, I need to see it. So I'm going to leave that here. It's a Parku retractable erasable gel pen clicker. Fine point, no need for white out. Assorted colors, inks for planners, and and then it's like office products. So let's just that. And let's do a pen test while we're here as well. So I'm going to grab a colored paper. We'll do blue. A blue piece of paper. Okay, so I want to blow this up a little bit to you. So again, they are erasable, retractable, and refillable. So you can refill these. This is the 0 0.7. I love me some 0 0.7. 0 0.5 are nice as well. I've been buying my 0 0.5s. But I love me some 0 0.7s. So this is the Clicker Gel Pen. You get seven colors. This is the information. So again, Parku writes smoothly, erases easily. The material is PP. Tip is a bullet tip, which I like my bullet tips. The pen dimension is 5.64 by 0 0.43 inch. Your writing length is about 885 feet. So it's not recommended for signatures, um, examination papers, or official documents. Okay. The ink will disappear in extreme temperatures, but to cool it to 10% to restore the color. So it says cool it to minus 10% to restore the color. So your color will come back and here's their website. Parkushot.com. So it's HTTPS colon backsplash backspace backsplash park who so P A R K O O S H O P dot com. And then it says attention please. Their little UPC and then the colors that it comes with. This is gonna be I like this. I love the case that they put it in. Like look at this. So it's a like a plastic type case, but it's like a heavy duty one. Let me bring this out a little bit. Because I know I'm going to be needing to do some writing. So let's open this up. Do you see how it's like a little snap it in? So let me show you. This little slice here goes into this little pocket. And it holds your pens really nice. I like that because it saves your pens as well. And it's like a little pen case. So it comes with, let's see, what is, how can I put this in the back? So you have seven pens and you can see the white tips on the top. You have a black, a blue, um, a red. It looks like another kind of blue, purple, green, and pink. So really basically your basic colors, it kind of looks like blue and then it kind of looks like a purple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm trying to see what this color is. Not this color. Yeah, this color. So let's do a pen test. 
And again, remember, this is refillable, so you can refill these. So let's put this here. Okay. So we are going to pick black. And we're going to do the erasing part two. So this is what the pen looks like. It feels nice in your hand. It's not a skinny pen. It's, yeah, I like the way you can write with it. It feels nice. It doesn't feel heavy. It's not lightweight, but it's not heavy. It is a clicker. So there is a clicker. It does come with that little white piece on the bottom. And they come off super easy. Do you see that? There's no residue. There are pens out there that this piece kind of leaves a residue. And then you have to keep like scratching it off. So let's try black. Nice. Okay, let's do it again. Let me put my cat in here. She's banging at my door. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. My cat, I don't know what is her problem today. I just came home and she wants to be in my room and then wants to leave, come back every time I close my door. So here's the black. Let me show you it. Lay down. You should see her in a few minutes. She's trying to come on my desk. And then I'm going to blow this up so I can show you even better. My hands are going to look huge. Yeah, maybe not that big. And then I'm just going to erase. And it erases really nice. I'm not doing a heavy erase because I want to show you that it is erasing. And then I don't want my hand to be like all in the picture. Okay, so a little pressure erases it, of course, obviously. Um, I do see a little bit of, uh, actually, well, kind of. You can kind of see where the color is when you erase it. But again, I'm not putting too much pressure, so... And this paper is so little as well. So I'm just erasing. So you do get a little shadow, which is not a big deal. You get a tiny bit of a shadow. And that could be because it's black ink. So we're going to try another color. So that's the black one. So here is the tip. Tip of my hand, really, Maserati. Here is the tip, a nice size tip. Let me blow this in because my hands look huge sitting here like that. Okay, so here we go. And then here you got the clicker, you have the rubber piece so you can grip and you're not sliding all over the place. It says erasable pen, parku. It is removed by friction. So the more you know you give it friction, the more it's gonna remove. And that's why I say you need to give it a little bit of pressure because you're taking ink off paper. But if you put this in cold, your ink will come back. See, the more I do it, the more it's coming off. So, I mean, plus I press hard when I eat right. So when I'm writing, I press a little harder than I probably should. And that could be, you know, one of the issues I'm having. So let's try this pretty blue. The only thing I wish it would say is like the actual colors. Like some companies will give you the color of the ink. Hot pink, um, teal, purple, things like that. I would love to see. So I'm going to do it again, exact same thing. Let me blow this up again. Sorry, I'm just going to probably have to leave it blown up. So blue. One thing I could tell you is when you start to write, you need to, you know, probably start to write it. So like on the back sheet, just go like that, just to get it to the ink to flow. It's not bad, believe me, because look at how cute that is. Now let's erase that. 
see the blue is coming out a lot easier with less pressure so it could have been just me putting too much pressure on it but yeah look at how fast that came off you can still see like the image and it could be the paper too um do i have a copy paper I wonder if I write on this sticker thing. Um, looking for like copy paper. Oh, I can't see any copy paper. But yeah, so you get a tiny bit of ghost. Just a tiny bit. But I mean, but if you made a mistake and you're re rewriting over it, I wouldn't see a problem with this. I don't see a problem at all with it. It does give a little bit of a ghosting. You do have to, you know, start the pen. Before you even write, if you had like a scratch piece of paper next to you, just just do something like that. Just to get it to start. I like the click part of it. I like this pen. It's really nice. So there's only a couple of things I would change with this pen. But nothing major. Nothing like... Nothing major. See? They all come with it. See? Here's red. I'm going to do red again. And now I'm going to erase. Let's see how well this erases on red. Okay, so the erase is good. It, and again, it's a shadow. So I would suggest, you know, maybe not so hard on writing. Don't put so much pressure like I do. But that's not bad though, because if you're trying, you made a mistake, you're trying to fix your mistake. I think that's not bad at all. And then again, parkour. But look at the tip, it's perfectly fine. And then it is refillable, so that is awesome. So you can buy refills. So I will link as much as I can, all my knowledge. This is a very pretty color, automatically. I think it's a royal blue, but I mean, this all together is a very pretty color ink. So let's check it out. I don't even know what color to call it, so let's see what color comes out. It's a blue. See, see how it starts like where, because you remember you're taking that little thing off. So see how it starts and then it starts to write nice. So let's put royal because this is a royal blue. And let's see how blue goes. I think the only suggestion I would say to the company, if it was me, and it's not even bad, is maybe it's the friction of the erasable. But you don't see any bleed through, just the shadowing. So that is not bad. Parku. Let's see the purple one. Ooh, purple. That's a very pretty color as well. And again, you gotta take that little white piece off to get it started. And we'll start it like that. That one started right away. And I'm just gonna write purple. And then just, I'm gonna do some squiggly lines this time. Okay, and then just erase. Watts, this one erased a lot better. And all I did was squiggly lines. Let's see if this erases this one. Look at this. So if you were to go like this to your paper and you try to sign something, right? You can so easily just erase this. This paper is so small that, yeah, it's bending on me. 
But look at this. Look at all this erasing I'm doing in a few minutes. A few seconds, not even minutes. I actually like this pen. I love the ink flow of it once it gets started. Did I seriously drop, drop my pen? Hold on, let me go grab a pen. Okay, it didn't go too far. It went into my tote. So yeah, I'm loving these pens. Like, really. These are some really nice pens. Few things I would change about it, but other than that, uh, I'm loving these pens. So let's see how green writes. Green is one of those colors that are not everybody's favorite, but can be. Like, it reminds me of Christmas. So, like, if you were to do something for Christmas, I would use a green pen. So, let's see. I love the fact they're gel pens as well. Not too bad. But see how, what I'm doing to the paper because it's so small? And that's me. That's not the company. Last but not least, we have pink. And we did seven. Well, we're about to do seven. The pink one is gorgeous. This pink one in that royal blue color is pretty. So we're going to go here with it. We're just going to write pink. And again, you have to start the pen first. So let's write it again. Make sure there's no film. And then just erase. Not bad. It really is not bad at all. And there you have it. My little crumbly paper that I did. But these colored pens are really nice. They feel really nice. The case is super nice. But look at these colors. You get seven pretty colors. I will link everything that I know about the pen below. The name of the company again is Parku. P-A-R-K-O-O. And I would definitely check them out because you know, they have some really nice pens. I am seriously impressed with them. They have it in order, but I don't know what order it was in. I don't remember. But we're just going to put it in here. I think it's like this, but I'm not sure. And then... Look at how cute that little case is. And you put them over here so you can lift them up easily. But it's a cute little case. And then just tuck in that flap. You got the clicker gel pen. Again, keyword, refillable. So you can refill these. Parku 0.7 mm. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please share the video, comment. That would be greatly appreciated. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. So that you don't miss out on any new videos. And it came super fast. Like, we just ordered it, and I was just emailing the lady the other day, and it came super fast. So, again, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I love pens. Like, I am a pen fanatic. Somebody on here called me um, something with pens, and it's true. I am a pen fanatic. I just bought some pens at Michael's, not knowing these were coming today. So again, thank you, and I will watch, uh, watch. I will talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.